Bird. I work for the Marine Life Center as a Marine Life Center representative. I've been there for almost three years now. Um, and the Marine Life Center is an educational facility on Salish Sea Marine Life through the Port of Bellingham. So typically we get octopus as nuisance animals for the commercial shrimping industry, but Marcellus came to us injured. Um, he came to us um, with cuts on his arms and he has made a full recovery. We kept him until he was gaining weight and he was healthy and happy to go back out. southern winds in there and so there was full sprays of water soaking everybody we tried to cram in the back of the boat underneath the covering and so we we're all trying to hold on and it was a little bit of a choppy ride It was dove down to about 24 feet uh, and there was uh, not great visibility but there was a little bit of eelgrass. Uh, John had the octopus and opened it up and kind of coaxed him out a little bit. It was pretty cozy inside of the bag we had it in. Yeah but uh, water temperature was at a cozy uh, 43 degrees so you know after he felt like uh, he was a little bit warm he warmed up to us and went off. No ink so just uh, just creased. And he used its uh, jet propulsion as it swam off and just disappeared, a shadow in the depths. Yep. They're just such incredible animals and they have a short lifespan. And it's so beautiful when they get to come in and be ambassadors to us, um, ambassadors of the ocean. And a lot of people can come in and just see how beautiful our local Salish Sea Marine life can be. A lot of people just don't realize what we have right there. And so now he is fully blossomed and he is ready to return to the wilds. And I'm just so happy for him to go live out his little octopus life out there. <laughs>